Hello, welcome to Torquato English Center. Okay, today we're going to see causatives. Causatives. The causative is a common structure in English. It is used when one thing or person causes another thing or person to do something. Basic causative structures. There are two basic causative structures. One is like an active and the other is like a passive. These examples use the causative verb have. I have John fix the car. I arranged for the car to be fixed by John. I caused him to fix it. I have the car fixed. I arranged for the car to be fixed by someone. We don't know who, so this is like a passive. The active causative structure. This is the basic structure of the active form, along with some more examples. Have something, someone, sorry, have someone do something. You have the subject, the causative verb, the agent, the action verb, and the object. Susan has her brother do her homework. The police have the suspect stop his car. We have the carpenter fix our window. The passive causative structure. In the passive form, there is usually no agent. The action verb is in the past participle and the object comes before it. Have something done. So you need have, the object, and the past participle. Subject, causative verb, object, and the action verb in the past participle. We have our door fixed. Okay, what does it mean? Um, do, do we do the, the, the action? No, we don't. We hire another person to do the action for us, okay? Rose has her hair cut. Dario has the windows cleaned. So, in all these cases, these people are not doing the action, okay? Someone else is doing the action. Other causative verbs. There are, there are many other verbs that can be used with causatives. In the active form, some of these verbs require the action verb to have two before it. These are some examples of the most common causative verbs. Sorry. Verb, meaning, form of action verb, and examples. For example, make. The meaning of make in this context is force, compel. The, the, the form of action verb is the plain form. Example, the robbers made us lie on the floor. Get. The meaning is the same as, ha as uh, have. But here we have to use the to form. So get is the same as have, but we have to use the to form. I got Jane to pick me up in the car. She got her hair cut. In this case, no to because it's the past participle, right? And then you have let with the meaning allow hmm? and the form of action verb is the plain form i let you borrow my bike no passive form no passive form right okay and uh, this is the end 
Okay, I hope you have found this useful. Okay, bye bye. See you in another video.